Some high school students planning a province-wide walkout today after the lifting of these mask mandates. Kids returning to the classroom first time after March break. Our Tammy Sutherland joining us live now in Scarborough, speaking to organizers of this protest and what they're saying for us. Tammy, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Mel. Spoke to one of the organizers just a few moments ago. She says that more than 50 schools right across the province will be taking part in this mass student walkout. It is set to start at 11 o'clock this morning, and the walkout will include uh, picketing outside of these schools, including 11 of which, which will be right here in Toronto, including Albert Campbell Collegiate, where I'm standing in Scarborough. Now, these students, they'll be demonstrating outside of the school, and in some cases, will be marching to local Local MPP's offices calling the lifting of the mask mandate in schools something that is risky and not being done in the best interest of students. Like the mask mandate is just the tip of the iceberg. Student needs are not prioritized in so many other ways. Like students and staff don't have access to PCR testing. That's suppressing our ability to report COVID cases in schools, to report outbreaks, which is both on an individual level of being aware that there's an outbreak happening in your school, but also on a provincial level, being able to accurately see what's the state of COVID in schools. That's, that's a major issue. The student group is also asking that standardized testing be put on hold, saying that the disruptions in the school year have already placed a great amount of stress on kids and that testing is just adding to that. Now, several school boards asked the province for more time before lifting this mask mandate, but last week the province denied that request to those boards, including the TDSB. But one place where you will still have to mask up is at schools within the Hamilton-Wentworth District School Board. That board saying that they will continue to enforce mandatory masking in defiance of the provincial order.